Hello, this is Chris with PixelFreak.com. Today I have a new find called Gyro. I guess it could be Gyro, but I think it's Gyro. Anyways, let's go ahead and boot this one up. Now I heard about this on Reddit, on the subreddit Android Gaming. It, they actually have some pretty decent conversations. I hang out there quite a bit. If you wanted to go check it out, you could actually talk with me if you want to there. I, I respond to quite a few comments there. Um, this is a very simple game. It's a free game. Let's see if I can get in the settings here. You can see I've actually unlocked the pro mode. So this is kind of a puzzle-ish game and I'll go ahead and deactivate the couple things that I've unlocked. Let's go ahead and just jump into the game. So this is a color matching game. And this is a very simplistic game, but I have found that in the last day, this has consumed a lot of my game time. This is it. What happens is, is you spin, whoop. My device is having a hard time. Sometimes it does that at the beginning of the game. Anyways, you spin this color wheel and match up the colors. And there are some power-ups, like that one gives me health. But there's a, a, a couple different barriers, and there's one that, like, that one right there, that blows up everything in the screen. And then as you go, and it looks like my device is having a little bit of a hard time because I'm capturing. Generally speaking, my device has not had a hard time with this game. And I am capturing it on my phone since... Uh, I kind of downloaded it on the fly and just started playing it and ended up really liking it. You can see that in the center, the multiplier, it goes up and it makes each little ball that you capture correctly worth more points. And then that levels up as you go. And you just go as long as you can. And it does get progressively more difficult. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, and they, and they throw some really tricky combinations at you. Like, oh, here's one. And the cool thing is you can control it two different ways. So I'm controlling it by spinning the wheel because I like to control it that way better. A lot of people like to do it the other way, which is to navigate horizontally on the vertical white line, or vertical, the horizontal white line there at the bottom. You can swipe your finger back and forth and that will also spin the wheel. And that's what I'm doing right now. I find that that's not, as sensi that's not sensitive enough for me. So I like to actually spin the wheel. The problem with spinning the wheel is, is your finger's in the way. So you can react a little bit quicker, but you have an obstruction. So this is it. Okay, there's, so there's a shield. So with the shield, I can bounce them off the wrong color. Ooh, there's a tricky combo. Uh, I can bounce them off the wrong color. Of course, I don't get points for that, but it's just a kind of a power-up that lasts just for a little while. Oh, that one was lucky. So that is... That's the game right there. Let me show you one more thing. Hit back and exit out. And I'll show you, as you go, you can kind of unlock a couple different items. Pro mode is one where you actually get more points. Start with increased difficulty. Oh, so you start farther in the game. That's what it is. Just allows you to start farther in the game because the game does get quite a bit harder towards the end. I also unlocked 8-bit sound, which is what you heard in the very beginning before I had turned it off. Let's go ahead and play like that. So now it sounds a little different and you're going to notice the difficulty is a little bit higher. So it started out by throwing one of those at me. And it does get really difficult too. Like it does start to throw us like some almost impossible combinations at you. Especially if your phone's just chunking along like mine is. I don't know what's going on here. This is not consistent with what I've seen in the past. But there you go. Now I have these little protective balls. Ooh, almost got damaged there. But you do take damage. Each color, the way it works is like, watch, watch me, I'll, I'll damage orange. See, it took some it took some damage there, and I can get a power up to get my health back up on orange. But each one is damaged individually, and if I lose, here let me lose. Oh, that's the end. Then it gives you your score and my name, which unfortunately they didn't have enough letters for me to completely spell out for shizzle. But I got faux shiz, and that works for me. Anyways, I can change my name here to. Come on now. To nothing. Oh, I have to touch where it says touch. There it goes. Faux shiz. Yeah, I swear when I did this the first time, it, I put in faux shizzle. But whatever. Yeah, it seems as if my device has completely locked up. So 
Anyways, okay, I'm just going to cancel this. I'm just going to back out. It's not, my device is not liking me. Um, but anyways, it'll probably run good on your device. It's probably because I'm capturing video right now. It's a fun game. It's a free game. Check out the link in the video description. This is an Android exclusive from what I hear on the subreddit. So don't expect to be able to play this on iOS. Go check it out on the Google Play Store. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Check us out on Facebook and Twitter. Check out our website. And until next time, this has been Chris with PixelFreak.com.